the reason why this race is so important, not just for Cochise County, but for all of Arizona, is because, <laughs> is because Cochise County is a cornerstone of so many other races. Uh, it is a mainly rural uh, county, and it is where we go to lose elections. So it's very important that we get this right, that we, that we well resource this race that is so key with candidates that are so key. Uh, let me explain who Ann is running against. Ann is running against uh, uh, the current recorder, Mr. Stevens. Uh, thank you, yes. Feel free to express yourself. Uh, who is a mega election denier. Uh, he is a close associate of uh, Mr. Mark Fincham, who you might be familiar with. Yeah. And uh, he encouraged uh, the, Pima, the, sorry, the, the Cochise County Board of Supervisors, the, the two Republicans on that board, uh, to refuse to certify the election in 2022. It was his advice that prompted them to do what they did, which they are now under criminal investigation for, I would remind you. Uh, it was Stevens who came up with the idea of trying to do a whole hand count of the entire count of Cochise County, which is illegal. Uh, so he is in his neck, up to, up to his neck, in election denial, uh, in the worst of MAGA politics, uh, and he's even actually trying to profit off of this by grifting himself into a, a state contract where he can get the contract for the special paper uh, that he and Mr. Fincham are trying to lobby the Arizona legislature to mandate we do our elections on, which would make our ballots trackable, which means that you no longer have a right to a secret ballot if that were to pass. So this is who we're up against. This is who this is who is running as an incumbent in Cochise County for recorder. And I think it's really important, desperately important, that the Democrats everywhere in Arizona understand who this man is, what he represents, and that we demonstrate very clearly that nowhere in Arizona is this kind of behavior acceptable from one of our elected leaders, especially one who is in charge of elections. So that's why we have to, and we will win this race. That's why we're here tonight. But there, of course, that's, that's a high-minded uh, reason. I also have a low-minded reason, and that's to win elections. I think we all want to do that. And so I want to point out that uh, when Kirsten Engel ran for Congress last time around, uh, she lost by less than five, well, just over 5,000 votes. And that vote deficit came from Cochise County. And so when we have a strong, principled, well-resourced candidate running countywide in Cochise County, like Ann, that lifts all Democratic ships that are on the ballot in Cochise County. Because if they, if they hear Ann, and hear her message about professionalism, about nonpartisanship in our elections, in making our elect, fixing our election, not even fixing our elections, they're not broken, but in making sure our elections are not run by partisan hacks and MAGA weirdos, uh, and that we can actually have, we actually have secure, accurate, accountable elections in Arizona, you know, and that democracy is on the ballot, more people will vote. More people who agree with the democratic agenda, not, not the big D democratic agenda, but the, but the democracy agenda of protecting our democracy against these fascists, then they will vote up the ballot as well. Because that is the message of the Democratic Party this year, save democracy from Donald Trump and his band of MAGA lunatics. Let's go in! So, by helping Ann, you're helping Kirsten. By helping Ann, you're helping Gallego. Does anybody here want Ruben Gallego to win the 
Does anybody here want Kirsten and Engel to, to oh, take yeah. that seat back for yeah. Sister Maga? Yeah. Does anybody here want to make sure that Biden Harris carries Arizona again? Yeah. Then this is a key race. Anne's race is a key race to properly resource so she can get that message of pro-democracy out there on the ground in Cochise County to every town, every city, every person that she can reach, every independent, every Republican who is amenable to that pro-democracy message to get them to go out and vote and vote for our candidates all the way up the ballot. That's how we win in Cochise County. And it would be very nice uh, if indeed we were able to capture more seats uh, on the Cochise County Board of Supervisors. We have Democrats who have filed statements of interest for all three seats uh, there. So, you know, we very well may be able to capture two or three or maybe all three of those seats if we work hard enough, if we put the resources where they need to be to make sure that Cochise County is trending blue this year. Yes. So, I don't want to say much else, but I do want to say this. I think if there were a single distillation of Anne's message, it is this that we don't need MAGA, we don't need to make America great again. America already is great. We are the greatest democracy in the world, and we're gonna keep it that way. And we're gonna make it so that we make elections boring again. Let me hear you say it. Make elections boring again. Thank you so much.